Before starting the video, I would like to tell you something about ibpsguide.com. In their website, they daily provide you with free questions which will help you boost your preparation of either banking examination or SSC examination. Also, you can check out their test series which has very high standard questions and also all the questions are accompanied by detailed solutions. Okay, so you don't have to wonder here and there for the solutions and also towards the end of the test, they provide you with analysis that how well you have performed which are the areas which you must work on also the tests are available in both the language that is hindi and english so you can switch between both the languages and it is accessible either on mobile application or desktop whichever suits you okay for more information about ibps guide quality mocks you can visit their e-store that is e-store.ibpsguide.com hello everyone welcome to ibps guide so in this particular video we will see a top 5 arithmetic question easy to moderate level for ibps clerk pre-2018 so without further delay let's see which is a first question so the average profit earned by a trader in the first three days of a week is rupees 6750 the average loss of the next two days is 3850 and what should be the average loss or gain per day he is talking about per day for the last two days so that there is no loss or no gain in the whole week so in first three days in first three days the average profit is 6750 now if i ask what is your total profit in these three days you will say 3 into 6750 this is a profit so terms to be positive so next two days he is saying average loss is there so average loss is 3850 but if i ask what is the total loss then you will say in negative format because there is a loss 3850 now for the next two days we don't know what is the value of x but we know that maybe a loss or maybe a gain but total profit or profit or loss will be 2 into x and also further he is saying such that there is no loss or no gain so if we add these three variable we get total is 0 so 3 into 6750 will give you 20250 negative because this because of this negative symbol so 2 into 3850 will be 7750 plus plus 2x equals to 0 if we solve this we know that what i get is 12550 c 12 550 five, plus 2x so what is the 2x value it should be in term of negative means there is a loss so per day loss will be x divided by 2 so 2 6 is 12 2 2 is 4 1 2 7 is 14 1 2 5 is 10 6 2 7 5 will be the correct answer 6 2 7 5. option number b will be the correct answer okay move on karte hain. question number 2 ki or so this is a question number two vehicles are grouped on the basis of their load capacity and the place in at least one group 20 are heavy load group category 30 are medium load category and 40 are in the light load category so basically it is from venn diagram so just draw venn diagram this is a heavy load and having 20 this is uh, your medium load having 30 and this is your light load having 40 vehicles. Okay. So, color change because you know what is happening. 5 vehicles are in both heavy load as a medium load. So, no. This is your ye pura, ye, ye wala term, jo, jo kar raho main. this and this. दोनों को ऐड करो क्योंकि ये किसका सर्किल है ये मीडियम वाले का और ये वाला किसका सर्किल है ये हाई वाले का तो मीडियम प्लस मीडियम प्लस हैवी लोड का कितना दिया हुआ है टोटल मीडियम प्लस हैवी लोड का टोटल दिया है 5 व्हीकल्स फादर ही सेइंग 6 व्हीकल्स आर इन बोथ मीडियम एज वेल एज लाइट कैटेगरी सो मीडियम एज वेल एज लाइट कैटेगरी सो दिस इज योर 
medium circle and this is your light category circle so this total is 6 Fada is saying 9 vehicles are in both heavy load as, as well as light so this is your heavy load circle and this is your light load this total is 9 vehicles and Fada is saying 4 vehicles in all 3 category it means this middle one 4 this value is 4 how many vehicles are there in total now see now see again फिर से देखो ये total कितना है आपको दिया हुआ 5 but उसमें से 4 तो ये इतना ही part है तो ये वाला part क्या होगा 1 होगा same यहाँ करेंगे ये total ये वाला portion total कितना दिया है 6 जिसमें से 4 तो यही हो गया तो ये कितना होगा 2 अब ये total की बात करेंगे जिसमें से 4 already है तो ये कितना होगा 5 ठीक है तो अगर हम कहें ये वाले portion की region की कितनी है ये कितना है ये कितना है तो देखो 4 plus 2 is 6 6 plus 5 6 plus 5 is 11 so ये कितना हो जाएगा आपका ये total कितना था 40 था जिसमें से ये और ये पूरा आ चुका है तो ये कितना होगा 29 होगा कि नहीं होगा agree इसकी बात करेंगे तो 4 plus 2 is 6 6 plus 1 is 7 और ये पूरा 30 था ये पूरा 30 था ये तो 30 minus 7 is 23 जो कि ये वाला पोर्शन है 4 plus 1 is 5 5 plus 5 is 10 और ये 20 तो ये पूरा 10 हुआ बचा होगा तो what he is asking he is asking how many vehicles are there in total now see देखो पहले तो ये पूरा count कर लो ये पूरा तो ये हो गया आपका 40 plus ये पूरे में आपका ये वाला पोर्शन और ये वाला पोर्शन आई चुका है 10 और लेना है plus ये one और लेना है plus इस वाले सर्किल को उठाया था ना तो ये पूरा आ चुका है ये वाला पोर्शन आ चुका है सिर्फ बचा ये 23 सो so 23 ये रहा तो कितना हो गया आपका 40 plus 20 is 60 60 plus 10 70 70 plus 1 71 71 plus 3 74 सो so टोटल वेहिकल्स इज 74 ऑप्शन नंबर बी विल बी द करेक्ट आंसर ठीक ना तो मूव ऑन करते हैं क्वेश्चन नंबर 3 की ओर Question number three: Aniket borrowed fifty thousand at the rate of fifteen percent per annum and thirty thousand at the rate of interest twenty percent per annum from the bank. He decided to lend the whole amount. Whole amount means fifty thousand plus thirty thousand in order to gain fifty five hundred. After the two year, find the least rate at which he should lend to gain the whole amount to uh, rupees five thousand five hundred. See clear? So, first of all. ये देखो टू ईयर की बात हो रही है और यहां पे 15% पर एनम है तो फॉर द टू ईयर कितना रेट ऑफ इंटरेस्ट हो जाएगा 15 2 दैट इज 30% 30% ऑफ दिस 50000 विल बी इंटरेस्ट विल बी 15000 ओके ऑन दिस 50000 नाउ अगेन 20% पर एनम बट ही इज फॉर द टू ईयर so for the two year rate of interest will be 2 into 20 that is 40% 40% of 30,000 will be interest will be 12,000 so what he is getting is 27,000 ok now he is saying he will, he will lend the whole amount in order to gain 55,000 gain 55,000 means now the total interest he won that is 55,000 add कर दो आप तो यो गया 0, 0 and 5, 2, 3, 3, 2, 5, double 0 is the total interest now he is won but the amount he lent that is principal is 80,000 ठीक है and the time is 2 year he won the rate of interest so interest is 3, 2, 5, double 0 interest equals to P is 80,000 into rate is we have to find out and the time is 2 period upon 100 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0 8 to the 16 so rate equals to 3, 2, 5 divided by 16 divided by 16 so 16, 2 times is 32 so 2, 0, 0, point 16, 3 is a 48, so 20.3 something percentage and option number A will be the only option, 20.31 percentage will be the correct answer. Move on, question number 4, okay?
Now question number four. A wholesaler purchased two type of pulses. One was costing rupees two hundred per quintal, and other was costing two sixty rupees per quintal. Now, if I ask which is costlier one, you will say two sixty per quintal one is a costlier. In fifty two quintal of the costlier pulse means this costlier pulse is fifty two quintal. How much two hundred pulses rupees two hundred pulses should be added such that he gains twenty five percent by selling them at rupees three hundred per quintal. Now see, there are the two type of pulses. First pulse is two uh, hundred rupees one, which is cost price CP, and this is two sixty rupees quintal one. This two sixty two sixty rupees per quintal one is given as fifty two quintal. Now he is asking about this on two hundred rupees uh, per quintal pulse. How much amount should be added? So we know that this is CP, this is CP. So in middle should be a cost price. So also we have in a twenty five percent profit means CP. And SP twenty five percent fraction value is one by four. Four is CP. Then one is profit. That is selling price will be five. Now he thinks by selling them at rupees three hundred per quintal. So this five unit value is three hundred. So how much time? Sixty times. So this one is also sixty times. So six four the twenty four sixty times. Okay, not six hundred sixty four. So this is two forty. So two forty will be the cost price. So we subtract if this. Two uh, sixty minus two forty will be the twenty, and two uh, forty for forty. Okay. So what I get that is this forty is fifty two. Then this twenty is how much? Forty is fifty two. So twenty is fifty two divided by forty into twenty zero zero two one zero two two zero four two one zero two. तो टू जो फोर टू सी जो छब्बीस ऑप्शन नंबर ए विल बी द करेक्ट आंसर ठीक है ना तो मूव ऑन करते हैं क्वेश्चन नंबर फाइव की ओर क्वेश्चन नंबर फाइव से ऑयल डीलर सेल्स ऑयल एट रुपीज सिक्स हंड्रेड पर बॉटल हाई वर ही फोर्स टू गिव अ टू सक्सेसिव टू सक्सेसिव डिस्काउंट टेन परसेंट एंड फाइव परसेंट रेस्पेक्टिवली हाई वर ही रिकवर्स द सेल्स टैक्स सेल्स टैक्स ऑन द नेट सेल प्राइस नेट सेल प्राइस मींस आफ्टर गिविंग दिस टेन परसेंट डिस्काउंट एंड फाइव परसेंट डिस्काउंट दैट प्राइस विल बी अ नेट सेल प्राइस फ्रॉम द कस्टमर एट फाइव परसेंट ऑफ द नेट सेल प्राइस व्हाट प्राइस डज द कस्टमर हैव टू पे हिम टू बाय द बॉटल नाउ इनिशियली द बॉटल प्राइस इज सिक्स एंड टेन डिस्काउंट टेन ऑफ दिस दैट इज सिक्सटी so you will get 540 rupees and on this 540 rupees 5% again discount so 540 ka 5% will be 27 minus 27 that is uh, 10 minus 7 is 3 and uh, 3 minus 2 is 1 and 5 513 this is a net sale price on this net sale price is taking a sales tax of 5% of this means 5% Five percent of this. So first we take out the five hundred thirteen ka five percent. We know the ten percent is fifty one point three. We know the one percent is five point one three. This is a one percent. This is a one percent value. So find out the five percent value. Just multiply it five on one percent. Yeah. So five three is a fifteen one five one is a five six point five five is a twenty twenty five point six five. So this is your interest. So total, what price should he, the customer have to pay is five hundred thirteen plus twenty five point six five. The total is five six five three eight two three five three eight point six five. Option number A will be the correct answer. ठीक है ना काफी easy question था ये. So if you like this video, do like, comment, and also don't forget to subscribe our YouTube channel, friends. And for the quality mock, just visit ipsguide dot com. Thank you for watching and have a nice day friends.